Smile, an interactive new way of engaging students with technology that's easily accessible to everyone. SMILE stands for Stanford Mobile Inquiry-Based Learning Environment. SMILE is a mobile learning management system specifically designed for a classroom environment. SMILE is a tool for students to interact with the curriculum by posing their own questions and entering those into a mobile phone and they're then sent out to the entire class for their classmates to answer. I like this because I get to make my own questions and think, like we get to learn from the questions we're making and answer other people's higher level thinking questions and get to use the technology and different method of learning. It provides technology that we can use instead of just reading and reading and listening to the teacher all, like, all day. Some students like just drift off and like hear nothing and stare off into space. So I think that a cell phone would actually make them learn more. I wasn't quite happy with the education systems that we have today. And I wanted to know if there's anything that I could do to improve that education systems around the world where students are freely making inquiries and finding answers by themselves. Students are taking exams with all the facts that they have memorized. That's a pretty typical scenario uh, in the classrooms today. With a smile, we are flipping that model where students are creating the questions by doing their own research. They are incorporating various images by taking photos and then also incorporating other mobile media. They're starting to think differently about the topics we're learning. They have always been used to us teachers and educators and parents asking them questions. And now it's them creating the questions. It's very interesting to see how they never thought about creating answers. And it was harder for them to figure out correct answers to the questions. So moving them in that di direction does require a lot of interest from them. And the, the engagement is 100%. You get to see all sorts of things that you've never seen before. And you get to create those questions and it's really fun. I like it a lot. It's fun to come up with questions and the ranking if we see at the end if we did a good question and why is it a good question and the, the options that they put, how that made it a good question. I get the most satisfaction in using SMILE in my classroom when I have students that struggle shine. Um, to me that was the first thing that really caught my attention about using mobile learning. That students that were hardly ever participating in class, students that were shy, students that, was, that had difficulties in interacting with other peers, just changed completely just in this classroom. Just because there was a tool they could use, they were familiar with, and it was easy to handle, and they could create their own work. And that is what really makes it interesting. I think one of the biggest advantages of SMILE is its flexibility. It doesn't come with a prescribed curriculum and can be used with whatever curricular resources a teacher has and is already using in his or her classroom. The only thing that's needed is mobile phones, a laptop, and a router. And the laptop works as the server to provide wireless internet to the phones. There's a smile plug being developed that would replace the need for the laptop and router and it would just all be self-contained in that plug. Smile is partnering with Marvell Technologies, a leading semiconductor manufacturer, to create the Smile plug. It will make the Smile program both cheaper and easier to deploy around the world. We're in the process of setting up a Smile consortium, which is a team that will be managing Smile to be open source and distributing it as a free software to classrooms around the world so that any teachers around the world be able to take advantage of this to enhance their teaching and learning. I designed Smile for really underserved conditions in the developing world. That's where I started the Smile project. And I wanted to make sure that it can work in extreme conditions. And as I did that, it made sense for a developed world like where we are here today. 
um, because it's so simple and it works in just about any conditions without depending on any infrastructure. Global Smile will be like a Wikipedia, so it will be like a wiki questions. People around the world will be able to create questions around anything that they are interested in and come up with a better questions every time. And that competition is a very exciting competition that we have created for the world.